The journey that's led us here from the night Michael died has been long and painful, but it has opened our eyes to the growing problem in our society. This journey has given us purpose and motivation to try and make a difference. Whilst we are grateful for our justice system and its ability to uphold the laws of our society, today's verdicts are not a victory. There are no winners here. It's not just our family who lost someone that they loved that night. The families of Tia Taylor, Chelsea Powell and Jake Hill have all been torn apart by the evil of that night, the presence of a knife. With no knife, the devastating ev events of that night would not have happened. The presence and use of a knife caused unmitigated violence, scarring injuries and haunting images that many will never forget. Michael watched the violence unfold in front of him. He felt the need to intervene, to remove the threat and protect others. In this task, he lost his life. We stand before you together to raise awareness of the damage that can be caused by carrying a knife. No good can come of it. Only anger, hatred, loss and grief. We aim to educate and to work collaboratively to tackle the root of the problem, to help our young people understand that a knife does not protect you or make you popular, and to give them the skills and tools needed to make a better choice in the future. We stand here together as a warning. If a change does not happen, then many more families will stand on court steps, broken from the loss that knife crime brings. We stand here together to beg you, leave it in the drawer. Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay Get that arm out now! Get that arm out now! Jake, listen to me! You're under arrest for murder and two attempted murders! You don't need to say anything! When they harm the fence, you don't mention when questioned something's later on in court. Anything you do say, maybe give them evidence. Okay.